Here's a fun patch. I'm using the DTG to clock the sequencer. And I'm using the new timbral oscillator here. And I'm first coming out of variable wave shape and I'm changing that wave shape with a sort of sinusoidal uh, CV coming out of a dual universal slope generator. And then that wave is coming out to the in of the variable uh, QVCF coming out of low pass and going straight into a mixer and it sounds something like this. And now I can get some variation of the variable QVCF by using row A. Oh, row C by the way is the pitch sequence you're hearing now. But if I use row A CV out, it will give me some variation, if I can find it, yep, uh, on the filter. And now I can take the saw and come out of there and go into a mixer, a VCA basically, and take that, uh, trigger it with the same pulse as triggering, clocking the sequencer, take that audio into its own little channel and now it'll have some attack on it. And blend them together. Okay, and the final thing is now still using the new timbral oscillator coming out of the triangle going into a wave multiplier and that's coming into its own little channel there whoops, sorry, into here. And now I can use a different row of the sequencer. Let's take A, no, D, for instance. So row D is going to vary the wave multiplier. Sorry. Okay. And now we can use that little triggering thing and we take a portamento in and pick a trigger. And take a FM in and pick another trigger. There you go.